Hey everyone, welcome back, and today we are going to be doing the products, if you've seen the previous video on my TJ Maxx experience, we're going to be using those products in this video, and I'm going to be testing them out today, so let's go ahead and get started. I'm just going to take off the glasses. Alright, so, I'm excited. Let's go ahead and start off with this face primer from Too Faced. I got that in a little travel kit in the last video, if you guys seen. And that was at Chi Mask. This one was sealed, so it is baby sized. Ooh, it smells really good. Oh. Okay. All right. With a um, over. Alright, alright. So that's what that is. I mean, it's not bad. I mean, I'm gonna get just a little bit and tiny more for my face. I like how they kind of give you like a testers in this that I found. That way if I do like it, I can go back and like buy the actual big product. You know what I mean? All right, and why do I keep smelling like coconuts? Ah, with coconut water. That's why. So that was the primer. And now let's do some foundation. So guys, this was not sealed, but I've been checking it over. <coughs> Excuse me. Wow. And I think, sorry if I saw was here. Anyway, I thought, all right, I've been checking this over, and I think it's going to be okay. I mean, it didn't look tampered with. <coughs> Excuse me. Wowzers. So, we are just going to go ahead and try some. Oh. Oh, God. Okay. Okay, so it looks darker than what I thought, and this was like a light beige. I wasn't for sure what color that was going to be, so... We shall see. Ooh, that smells good though. It's um infused with juicy watermelon and fresh cucumber. So hopefully nobody's used this. Knock on wood, fingers crossed. Let's just do this. Yeah, I'm kind of wondering if this isn't gonna be too dark. Huh? Well, maybe. It smells amazing. Okay, and with any foundation, you want to pull it down so that way your neck and face are the same color. There we go. I feel like it didn't want to open. I'm also using my new beauty blender that I had there, or got there, I should say. And I probably got a little bit too much, but YOLO. I shouldn't say YOLO. I mean, you live every day. You only die once, but, you know. And, of course, always, when in doubt, you blend it out. Had a little bit of extra, and that's why it's going back on my face here. Alright, so, I mean, not bad. Like I said, I'm usually not a foundation type of girl, but I don't think this is terrible by any means. So there's the foundation. So I got a Better Than Sex Mascara. This was sealed in that little to-go package. So let's do that. This is like by far my favorite mascara. All 
All right. All right. I'm gonna call that good with that one. Okay. And so I got two different primers. I got in the to-go kit a Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Longwear Matte Bronzer. But then I also got this that wasn't sealed, but we're going to take a chance. Uh, Too Faced Sweetie Pie Radiant Matinee Bronzer as well. But this is infused with Peach Fig Cream. So I think we do one on one side, one on the other. Let me get out my blender brush from e.l.f favorite brush by the way so let's go on with this one on this side this is the Too Faced Chocolate Soleil I hope I'm saying that right Sol Soleil and just look how itty bitty that is all right I miss you showing up real well all right and to be honest with you guys I have this in another package that I got or I uh, should say a holiday collection um I believe it's let it snow girl it's a little snowman one from Too Faced so I already kind of knew walking into this what this one was but I'm not mad at it it's all right so I kind of knew what it was gonna I mean what was gonna happen but that's okay we're here to test everything out I'm just trying to blend that just a little bit more so there's that side and now we're going to go on at the other side with the sweetie pie one now like i said this wasn't sealed but i checked it over my husband looked at it and it, this part looks just like that it looks like a pie this part has not been disturbed from when i unless i put my finger in it you last night when i looked at it so i'm gonna just assume it's okay Okay. All right, she's there. I also got this headband there at TJ Maxx, by the way, FYI, and I love it. All right. I mean, there's still that sticky part on the mirror yeah, that you get before you, or right after you buy it that you take off so all right it's not bad i like both i like that this comes with a mirror too and of course the other one was like travel size so obviously it did not but that's okay i don't know i'm kind of gravitating more towards this side so i do think the sweetie pie one is just a little bit better. Not that there's anything wrong with this one. I just kind of, I don't know. I feel like this one isn't as dark as this one. And I'm so fair skinned that anything super dark on me like really stands out. But I like it. So that was that. And now I think let's go ahead and try. This came in that little to-go kit. Uh, Too Faced Shadow Insurance. I like the name. 24 hour anti crease eye shadow primer. Does this smell? It doesn't say anything about smelling, so it's okay. All okay. Mm. All right, that's different. All right, so there's that one. Let's go to the other one. They had a concealer there, but it was all like too dark, definitely not in my shade. So I just didn't grab one. All right, all right, not bad. Cool. So that was the um, 
eye primer. Now let's go in with this. This is also, well, everything's from TJ Maxx today, or Max today. But anyway, this is a Revolution Makeup Revolution London Ultra Eyeshadows. Um, you get 32 Ultra Professional Eyeshadows. Packaging's great. Like, look at that. Um, this is the Mermaids Forever collection. And this was definitely all sealed, so that's why I got this for sure. Otherwise, if the eyeshadows weren't sealed, I wasn't going to get it. And I actually checked and opened it all up last night. There's a little piece that fell out that you get it when it's new. And look at all those. I mean, you get... Like, that's a variety of colors there. Wow. Hmm, 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 hmm. I'm feeling kind of like something orange today. Like... I don't know. Let's do orange. I'm feeling it. So I am gonna do my eyeshadow C. Or no, that's the concealer. We don't want that. We want our e.l.f. eyeshadow or the uh, ba eyeshadow brush. This is not from the store, TJ Maxx, by the way, but that's alright. Let's go in with this shade right here and I love 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 when eyeshadow palettes come with mirrors so they were definitely thinking of me thank you So, I mean, it's only on this eye right now. It's kind of hard to see. So, I'm wondering if I just need to go in with it again. Alright. No, not terrible. So there's this one. So then there's that. I mean, looking at the eyeshadow itself, it looks pretty cute. Um. I just thought it would look brighter, but maybe that's just was me. I will say now looking at a mirror closer up with this foundation, it's so-so. I mean, I'm definitely seeing spots where it's like not doing what I wanted to do with that makes any sense. And I think it's actually too dark for me. I mean, you could definitely tell that I am wearing foundation for sure and I'm not really much about that I don't know Meh. it wasn't exciting to me by no means but it wasn't terrible if that makes sense but now we're gonna go in with another color just because I feel like hey we have this palette let's test out a bunch of colors so let me get my detail brush from moda and for giggles here let me get out my sm shader brush as well i think what i'm gonna do is style this orange with hmm, i don't know let's try this green right here and see how that looks I just think that this shade is definitely too dark for me, the foundation, I mean.
So there's the green. I do like this green a lot. I'm not sure the colors really go together, but hey, why not? And I'm going to pull that down like so. Like I said, I'm just kind of playing around today, guys. I don't really have like a theme, just doing something for sure with it. It's not bad. And then I'm going to go in with this kind of like a cream white right here and just kind of put it right here in my eye just kind of for some I don't know for some reason like that like that and then Alright, so there's that. Woo! Like I said, guys, I was just playing around. I don't know what I'm doing. So, all in all, I mean, for all the shades you get, I do like this palette. Maybe it was your user error on my part with that orange. I just thought it was going to be brighter than what it was, but it is not. But that's okay. That's fine. I'm not mad or anything like that. I do like it. As far as the foundation goes... I am just not feeling it. I think it's too dark for my skin. But hey, we tried. That's all right. So anyways, that is it for today. Here is my random -ness look for today. I wanted to test these guys out, and I did. I would say the headband's awesome from TJ Mask. These uh, beauty blenders that I got, I got like a four pack. These work amazing. I do like those. Um, I do like both of the bronzers. I tend to gravitate towards this one just a little bit more on this side of my cheek than I do on this side on this side of the cheek. But I do like both. Um, I also really, really like the, um, I mean, it didn't smell or there was really nothing to it, but the um primer i mean it, it felt okay wasn't really nothing exciting but it felt okay of course i like the better than sex mascara that was awesome it's doing wonders i know my eyes aren't even and they look kind of funny but i'm just playing around with this orange and green um the Too face repelishing face primer i mean it smelled pretty decent so there was that i mean i don't dislike it um as far as the bit too faced full coverage face foundation no and i'm not gonna say it's user or i'm not gonna say it's their fault i'm gonna just say the shade is too dark for me and i'm not a huge foundation type person anyway but that's all right but anyways that is it for today's video also, I wanted to say real quick, I am thankful for the fact that I have cable television. I know that sounds completely bad, but I, I love cable TV. Real big fan. But anyway, that's it for today, and I will see you guys with a new video sometime soon. Bye.